What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Misha. And I'm doing, this is like really my first vlog, so I'm so excited. And I cannot wait to start this journey. So y'all bear with me, because like I said, it's my first time. But anyway, for those of you who don't know me, let me fully introduce myself. My name is Demisha Butler. I'm 18 years old. That sounds so good to say. I live in Miami, Florida. And I have sickle cell disease, anemia. And sickle cell disease anemia is a chronic in illness that causes pain in every area in your body. And trust me, it's not easy living with sickle cell disease at all. And I have my days when I don't even want to get out of bed. And I have my days when I have fits, almost, if you want to call it like that. And I just cry and cry and cry and just ask God, why do I have to have this disease? But... As I'm getting older, I realize that God gave me this illness for a reason. And I don't know that reason yet, but hopefully I will find out, find out why soon. But um, I just graduated high school, class of 2014, and I'm going to college now at um, Miami Dade. And I'm really excited about it. It's a new journey, it's a new st step, and everything. And, um,. Just want to get sickle cell disease out there. And I'm not doing this vlog just because of the sickle cell. Because that's not all me. I'm doing this because I want people to know me. Some people say I'm quiet and shy. Some people say I'm mean. I have an attitude. And to let all of you guys know, I'm none of that. And just please just bear with me and everything. And I want to be frequent with these vlogs. I want to... I want to, I'm not doing this for the money. People say, oh, you're doing this for the money, for YouTube and stuff. I don't care about the money. I mean, I'm not poor and I'm not rich. And I don't really care about the money. And stuff. I mean, if I get it, and thank you, Lord, it's a blessing. But I, I don't really care about it. I'm doing this because I want to get the word sickle cell out there. Because a lot of people do not know about it. And people, and people who do know about it, some of them probably think, oh, it's sickle cell. It's no biggie. You can handle that. But actually in reality it's a really 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 tough disease to live with just like cancer I mean I have nothing against cancer I mean I know cancer is um very bad to have and it's dangerous and everything it can cause um death but so can sickle cell a whole lot of people die from sickle cell and for me let's say for an example I get a cold and you get a cold it's going to be more deadly for me to get a cold because of my illness, sickle cell disease. And I can get pneumonia and I can easily die. And probably get other infections. And I have been in a hospital from like my whole life. I've been there maybe more than a million times. I've probably been in the hospital more than Bill Gates and Donald Trump had money and stuff. You know, they have millions and billions of dollars. Especially Dr. Dre. Now, you know, you got that money. Call me Dr. Dre. But anyway, off track. Sorry. But I've been in the hospital so many times. And it's, it's, I'm just sick of it. And I just thank God that I haven't been in the hospital for almost a year. And I'm definitely going to celebrate that. December makes a year since I've been in the hospital. But, um... Also, forgot to remind you that I, at two weeks old, I, I was diagnosed with sickle cell disease. And at six months, I had my first crisis. And after that, I just been in the hospital a whole lot. But it seems like after elementary school, when I hit middle school, and that's when I was starting to get, puber get into puberty. And I started being in the hospital more and more, and I started having pain more and more. And... Now, um, like I said, I thank God that I haven't been there lately. I haven't been in the ER, no nothing. Thank you, Lord. But um, it's not easy. And for those of you who are wondering of uh, how I'm going to be when I grow up, when I get older and become an adult, and I can get married, I can have kids, and I can do anything anybody else can do who doesn't have any illnesses at all. Because I'm telling you, I mean, I might, I might be sensitive and everything, but... I'm a fighter, and I believe I'm a fighter. I know I'm a fighter. People don't have to tell me that I'm a fighter, because I know in my heart that I'm a fighter. Like I said, it's not easy living with sickle cell disease. I just, I wouldn't wish this this illness on anybody. And 
I just, I know I have this illness for a reason. And one day, one day, I will find out why. But I just want to, I just want to get this illness out there. And like I said, I'm not doing this vlog just because, my, to talk about my illness or anything. But if anybody out there who has sickle cell disease or who don't have sickle cell disease, if you have any questions, just please like leave it in the comments below and just let me know and I will answer them as quickly as possible and, I, and as I can. And people who do have sickle cell disease who's older than me, um, I really do have some questions for you. And people who are younger than me who have sickle cell disease, if you need to ask me any questions or you have any questions to ask me about what I've been through and from the previous years and everything and from now, then please just let me know and I will definitely ask, answer them and stuff for you. And, um, yeah, like I said, I'm just, I just take it day by day and every day is not easy. I mean, like at this minute, I'm having pain and like in my my arms and my back and everything, my legs and everything. But like I said, I'm a fighter and I can bear through it. And um, but yeah, I just I'm just like I said, I'm doing this vlog not just on sickle cell disease, even though I really do want to get it out there. And I hope I can touch people's hearts about my illness and. Because I want to I wanna accomplish so many things. Like, for example, I want to be a respiratory therapist and stuff when I grow up. And that's what I'm going to school for. And I want to get married and have kids and everything. Not too many. Not, uh -uh. <laughs> and I want to, I just want to, I live a normal life. And I don't want people to treat me different just because I have an illness. And I don't want people to feel like it's contagious because sickle cell disease is not contagious at all you cannot catch sickle cell disease but if how you can get sickle cell disease if your parents have sickle cell traits if both of them have sickle cell trait and then you get sickle cell disease and you can read about it and everything I don't want to bore you guys and stuff with the information but please read about it and if you have any more questions just leave it, leave it in the comments below and like I said I want to I want to build up my YouTube account I want to build up my vlogs and everything so any other vloggers out there please I have questions for you so if you watch this please just let me just let me know what I'm doing so I can build up more and everything and just whoever watching this thank you all for watching this and stuff and just please bear with me and just join me on this journey of life this journey of living with sickle cell disease and thank you all for watching I really appreciate it and I love you guys already of course and I'm going to try my hardest to do as best as I can and fight on because, like I said, I'm a fighter. And I just, I just thank God every day that I have the parents and the family that I have who are very supportive of everything, of my dreams. When I had the dream to write a book or the dream to be an actress and everything where a teacher or a businesswoman and a respiratory therapist they're always standing by me and I just thank God for them and everything so just thank you all again for watching so see you guys next time